good morning my loves and happy monday if you are new here welcome if you're not new here welcome back since you know it's nothing but love over here on this channel today is monday november 29th and so yeah today is monday november 29th i have so so many things to do i will be bringing you guys along with me i have to go to home depot i have to go to Publix, target you name it i have to go so um we're gonna get the day started but before i head out of the house I am going to sit down and I am going to write down a very detailed list of everything I need because I do not want to forget anything. I am cooking oxtails, rice, and um, cornbread for dinner tonight for the kids. So I also have to pick that up. And I just have a few other things to do today. So I'm going to bring you guys along with me. Today is Monday, you guys. So be sure to sit down take time to yourself to write out your goals to write out your vision for the week things you need to accomplish whether it's small goals big goals in between goals whatever it may be sit down organize yourself and get ready for the week let's make this a productive week we're in the last quarter of 2021 i mean december is literally a couple of days away my daughter's birthday is coming up she will be six on december 3rd so it's just a lot going on right now and i want to get organized i've been really deep cleaning the house getting rid of a lot of things you know the new year's is coming and i just want to get my life together in order okay <laughs> so we're about to get the day started i'm gonna sit down write down my list of things that we need for, that i need and then we're gonna head out so yeah, I hope you guys are having a beautiful, productive Monday. Just to show you guys really quick, this is the scent of the day for me. It is Good Girl Gone Bad by Killian. Absolutely love it. So yeah, this is the scent for the day. Really cute bottle. You know, whatever girl smelling good over here. So yeah, that's the scent of the day. So you guys have seen this book before. Um, it's just a little journal that I have. I write down my goals. I write down my thoughts, to-do list, all that good stuff I write in here. And it just says new day, new mindset, new focus, new intentions, new results. So this is my go-to book. So I am going to write down my to-do list for the day. And the um, different places I have to go and under each place, I'll write down the items that I need. So it could um, keep me on track. And you guys see my nephew's school pictures? I forgot, I put those in there. These are my nephew um, fall school pictures. So cute. My sister just brought this to me not too long ago. I need to put those up. I totally forgot I slid it in my book because I literally always have this um, journal with me. It has a little space for the day and then I like to write my um, title at the top so yeah let's get to the to do list okay as you guys have seen i have made it to the home depot so i'm gonna go in and get what i'm looking for i'm actually looking for um a i'll just show you guys when i get inside because i can't remember the name of it I cannot remember the name of the product that I need, but I know it's like a um, fire ant killer. It's supposed to be really good. I've been having an ant issue in the kitchen and around the front door area. So I'm looking for that ant. Fire ant killer. I think I see it. This one is what I'm looking for. It is 12. So I found what I was looking for. Is this the guy 
who works in the department told me that it smells really, really bad, but I hear that it works really good, so. He is so cute. How adorable is that? So, off to the next stop. I just um, left out of the Home Depot. I got exactly what I needed. So now, I am going to head to Dollar Tree. I also have to go to Publix and Target, so got a really busy day but we're being productive on this monday we're getting things done so off to the next one about to pick me out some protein powder. Um, let me show you guys the one I'm gonna get. Is this? No. So I'm in between the vanilla by Oregon and the protein with greens by Via. Uh, this one is 19 99 this one is $18.99. Probiotic fiber, has a little sugar. 150 calories. So now let's see what the other one have. And all the vitamins, all that good stuff. So, um, I might go with this one because it's protein and greens. So, I might give this one a try. Yes, yeah, so I end up going with the organ protein. I did a little research, and this one has really good reviews. I'm gonna try this one. Cannot come to Target without getting my favorite grape. So yeah, I was really out here partaking in risky behavior. I had to ask the lady at Target for me a mask because I guess I left my mask. Well, you know, I guess I left my mask at home. Partaking in risky behavior. No oh, man. So, I am in Dollar Tree. I came to get a few things. Oh, the cutest little stuff. Can't beat that. Um, I am getting these to clean the um, stove top. If you guys have ever used these before, comment below. Let me know. Do they work? Because this will be my first time ever using this particular brand. So, yeah. So remember you guys, I said this is my favorite kombucha, but I actually really like this one too. It's a really good kombucha. It is not as strong as this one. As this one. So I grabbed the last two of this flavor. This is a really good kombucha. It's not as strong as the ginger lemon one that I drank. And it has a dollar off coupon, so that's definitely a bonus. So I grabbed two of those. back from the store and I'm just gonna show you the different things that I got from each store so it's like a mini haul a mini grocery haul so my first stop was Home Depot and I showed you guys what I got the um the ant killer I really didn't want to put it by the food and stuff just because it is a poison and although it is sealed it's just I didn't want it around all the food and whatnot so from Home Depot I got the ant killer and then I went to Target, Target, and I picked up this um, organic organ. 
protein powder and the vanilla flavor because I feel like vanilla is the perfect base. It looks like that. I also picked up some grapes because I absolutely love Target grapes, my favorite. So after I left Target, I headed over to Dollar Tree. And from Dollar Tree, I got the Santa hat because I um, plan to incorporate this into my Vlogmas intro. So I'm gonna do something cute with this. And then I also picked up some paper towels, some um, Broil Basics, Brillo Basics, which is like steel wool because I didn't see the regular steel wool. So I'm gonna use this to clean off my stove top. I also picked up some sponges to wash the dishes. I picked up, um, let me see. I picked up these pans right here because I will be making cornbread. It came with three, three in a pack, can't beat that. I'll be making my cornbread in that. I picked up some toothpaste. I picked up two, one for my bathroom, one for my kid's bathroom. I also picked up this powder. I like to use this baby powder like on the mattress when I change the sheets for sheets. I like to sprinkle it. It smells so lovely. I really like it. Do anybody else do that or is it just me? Okay, so that's what I got from Dollar Tree. So moving right along to Publix because where I live, Publix is directly next to Dollar Tree. So I stopped in there. I picked up canned milk. Cornbread mix for tonight's dinner. Um, another brand of kombucha that I really like, as I was saying inside of the store, you guys, if the ginger lemon kombucha by Health Aid is too strong or too potent for you, um, this is a very minor tasting, I'm gonna say, yeah, a very minor tasting kombucha. It's not harsh, it tastes really, really good, and it's kind of sweet as well. This is the berry hibiscus. I also like the maca, but they only sell that one at the Whole Foods by me. They don't sell it at the Publix. So check this brand out, 221 Kombucha gives you energy. It's amazing. So I also picked up some extra, no, some pure olive oil from Publix. It's the Publix brand as well. Let's be resourceful. And I also picked up this fabric softener because it was on sale, so why not? Absolutely love this, have your laundry smelling amazing. So then I went over to the meat store. I picked up some breakfast sausage. I picked up some oxtail. Just for this small bag, it was $30.44. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's not that much, but I'm only keep cooking for my children. So it's not that many of us here in the house. I'm a family of five. And then I also picked up some more breakfast sausage if you guys are familiar with georgia best sausage comment below this is a very popular breakfast sausage and miami you could do so many things with it so yeah and don't forget you guys take your receipts and scan them into your fetch rewards because fetch rewards actually give you um it's like cash bag money back but it just go to gift cards so um, I'm gonna put everything up, start my dinner, and then change too because I'm kind of hot. Got compliments on my shirt today. Absolutely love this top. But I am gonna sit down a little later on when I find some free time and I am going to scan my receipts into my Fetch Reward account and gather some points. The holidays are coming up. It's the perfect time to save and also to utilize what you're already gonna need. Like, you're gonna get a receipt regardless. So why not just take a moment, scan it on your phone and get points. Next thing you know, you have a $25 Amazon gift card when you're just gonna throw the receipt away anyway. So bang for your buck. Keep your receipts, scan your receipts into Fetch Rewards. So yes, my love, I am about to.
beautiful and worthy of living the life you deserve. Thanks for watching, sis. Until next time.